Prince Philip is rarely seen out in public seeing he stepped down from royal duties, but the Duke of Edinburgh did spend Christmas at Sandringham with the rest of the family, but where is now? The royal family traditionally spends Christmas and New Year at Sandringham House. The Queen's Norfolk House has been the venue of Christmases since 1988, when Windsor Castle had to be rewired and the family returned to Sandringham. Every year, the family make the short walk to attend the Christmas Day church service at St. Mary's Magdalene Church based on the Queen's Sandringham estate. However Prince Philip was nowhere to be seen this year, as members of the royal family including Meghan and Kate, Prince William, Prince Harry and Prince Charles made the walk to the church ahead of the royal family's traditional Christmas dinner. The Duke of Edinburgh was also not seen alongside the Queen as she travelled to Sandringham for the Christmas break on December 20 by train. He was believed to be travelling to Norfolk by car. According to the Daily Mail, the 97-year-old has not been seen in public much since he stepped down from public duties in 2017. His last public appearance was before Christmas when he was seen attending the Queen's annual Christmas lunch at Buckingham Palace. He was joined by his daughter Princess Anne and son Prince Andrew. It was his first public outing since Princess Eugenie's wedding in October last year. Is Prince Philip still at Sandringham? Prince Philip is most likely still at Sandringham with the Queen, as she only returns to Buckingham Palace after February 6, as this is the date of her father's death anniversary. King George VI died suddenly on February 6, 1952, at the age of 52. It is likely that Prince Philip is also at Sandringham with the Queen until this date, or even longer. According to the Daily Mail, the Duke of Edinburgh spends his retirement at Wood Farm Cottage on the Sandringham Estate in Norfolk. A source told the publication, it is away from the public eye and it's so peaceful and such beautiful location. He also spends time at Windsor Castle, the Queen's weekend home and goes to Buckingham Palace on the odd occasion, like for Remembrance Day. He very much enjoys Wood Farm, and he and the Queen still see each other at some point in the week or weekends. The Duke used the cottage as his retirement base, and paints watercolors, writes letters and has friends to stay. A courtier said, the Queen feels the Duke has earned a proper retirement. She knows him too well. If he was still at the center of royal life he'd feel he had to be involved. Being at Wood Farm means he's not too far away, but far enough to be able to relax.